Hey everybody, welcome back to another vlog. I know it's been a very long time since I've put out a vlog. I've honestly been chilling. I've actually uploaded a life update, get ready with me. So if you haven't watched that, then go ahead, watch it. So yeah, you'll get like the gist of what's been going on in my life and why I really haven't been vlogging. But honestly, I struggle with vlogs. <laughs> I just feel like I'm just such a homebody where I'm not really out and about all the time so I don't really do much um, and I just kind of feel like I'm constantly having to do something with vlogs and I know a lot of people are like oh you could just be in the house and we could just watch you and Zane and you know we'll be good with that but you know realistically I'm not doing anything in the house like you'll literally just be sitting there watching me watch TV walk Zane you know and maybe do work or whatever so that's why I just I just honestly struggle with vlogs but anyway um i have a few updates i'm gonna show you but i'm not gonna show you right now because i'm about to take zane to the vet and then i'm gonna do a little bit of fall shopping so i'm gonna have to show you like whenever i get back but i just wanted to come on and say hey girls okay we're starting a new vlog it's going to be like a fall you know type of vlog i know it may be a little bit too early for fall but but when i did the poll the other day y'all said y'all wanted fall content so i'm giving y'all fall content okay but anyway so today i'm about to go to like i said drop Zane off at the vet and then I'm going to um do a little bit of fall shopping and that's really it I do have to record like some videos probably when I get back and I also need to um start editing some videos and things like that but I'm just going to show you my outfit really quick and then we're going to head on the road I'm sorry you guys the room is a little bit junky because I just got back from Savannah Georgia but this is my outfit I am wearing the Skims Outdoor 2 collection and it comes with this little hoodie like little zip up jacket right here this little muscle t-shirt and then these what is these oh like these kind of like biker shorts or whatever you can make them a little bit longer if you prefer and i am going to be doing a review on the skims outdoor 2 collection because i just got a whole bunch of stuff literally it's like right there My shoes that i always wear I'm not exactly, I think they're like the casual, Nike casual shoe or something like that. Um, it will be a link down below. My LV vanity bag, <clears throat> my JBW watch here. I don't know if y'all can see it. Yeah, my JBW watch here. That will be linked down below. My Christian Dior bracelet. And then I also have a Christian Dior necklace that I just got whenever I went to Vegas. So yeah, that's what we're wearing today. Oh, and then I also got some new prescription glasses. You're gonna see one because I'm about to wear them out. And, uh, but I'll give you all those updates in a little bit. So yeah, let's go. All right, you guys. So I am headed to take Zane to the vet and then I'm going to head to like a few stores. Now I'm looking for fall decor, but I already have some fall decor in my storage unit. But you know how like, I don't know what theme I wanna go with this year, like what colors, like a cranberry-ish like type of color you guys seen it so i don't want to go with that again even though it's still pretty and it makes like the space warm i just want to see I, I don't know what colors i want to go with like i really like neutrals but at the same time i really like to stay in like the neutral family like now i'm just so into that but i do want to experience like a little color that's a little bit warmer than what i have now um i'm thinking about like like maybe like a burnt like a burnt orange or something you know something like deep and orange but not like too bright and orange or something so that's what i'm thinking about i don't need to be spending any extra money on like fall decor because like i have a lot of fall decor in my storage but you know every year you want something new you like you go into these stores you like dang that look cute or whatever so yeah i'm gonna look into that um like while zane is at his appointment like i don't know how long it's going to take but while he's at his appointment maybe i can do like a um we can go to target and uh home goods and see something this is one pair of glasses that i got um i am so like in love with them um so yeah i'm gonna show you the other pair when i get back to the house um but yeah these are my prescription glasses i really do like these um they are crystal or clear if you hear something whining that's zane he like he just gets so excited to be <laughs> in a car but anyway so yeah i'm gonna just catch you guys whenever i uh get to those locations <laughs> Oh 
love for you every time I try to resist Taking it away, I'm just this fool feeling every day All I wanna hear is an every single replay Staring next to you some nice items um, that I wanted to look a little bit more into but um Zane is ready so I had to I gotta go get him oh lord that just hurt so bad but anyway so yeah he's ready so I need to go and get him um I did get a few things I'm gonna show you that I don't know if I want to do like a fall decor haul and show you then or if I should just show you I don't know why it's always dark or I should just show you oh I did turn it down a little bit no it is like completely dark or if I should just show you whenever I get uh, to the house because I'm like having a hard time between like what colors I actually want I'm thinking that I'm just gonna still keep it neutral warm tones but like warmer than what I have now and I'm thinking more of like I don't know if I should do brown or whatever I still want to just keep it in like that neutral you know type of family but then I do want to add color it's like so hard because like I now have the couch to do that with like I can add so many different colors you know what I mean and I was just really excited about it so now it's just really hard because I don't know which color I really want to go with. That was too bright. I'm sorry, you guys. Like, the color is just too off. I don't know. It's just really getting on my, on my nerves. So, I made it back from all the stores. I'm not even going to lie. It's actually the next day. And I put on the same outfit <laughs> from uh, the next day. I mean, from the um, from yesterday. Um, so, yesterday I went to Home Goods, I believe. Yeah, home goods. And today I actually went to um, at home and Target. So I'm just gonna show you everything that I got. Um, I did get like a lot of stuff, like more than I wanted to. As far as like, I, I spent more money than I wanted to. But I'm actually really satisfied with everything that I got. I am gonna like see if it works in my space and stuff. And if I don't like it, then I am going to return it. Um, because like I said, I spent too much money and I need to get back into the habit of returning things that don't work for my space. Um, also, I did get my eyebrows done today. So they are darker than normal. So don't mind that girl, they will fade in a few days. But yes, y'all, it is fall, okay? I'm excited for this fall content. And actually, I had my first pumpkin spice latte the other day, Monday actually, and then I got it again today or whatever. But I'm gonna wait, okay, cause I really do like it. And I'm not, I've never had pumpkin before, so I didn't think that I was going to like pumpkin, but I actually really like it. So, girl, that's about to be my drink for the fall. So yes, let's go ahead and get into this fall home decor. First thing I got is this big, 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 wreath here love 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 just everything about this is giving me the neutral vibes that i want giving me very earth vibes as well so i am so in love with this it has like a little bit of everything it's really big oh so yeah this is the first thing that i got well, it's not the first thing that i got well it's actually the first thing i noticed and y'all i'm so sorry if my camera looks weird like it's really been acting up next thing i got here is this scarecrow i got this from at home so this is how it looks so the next thing i got is this little i don't know what you would call this but it kind of looks like a tree stump and it just has like these little legs on it so i was thinking about putting this in the bathroom and creating like a little nice little area in the bathroom or something i don't know why like my camera it's so, I hate, I'm gonna have to get a new camera. I also got this little fall decor, like wow, like little situation. I'm not exactly sure what you would call it. Got this sensational candle. I love just the color of this. Like it definitely gives me fall vibes and it's going to go perfectly with my decor. 
it smells so good you guys but this is in onyx number 15 so if you see this in home goods definitely get this i got two of these so i got two candles the same one right yeah i got these pumpkins oh i love this pumpkin you know me girl it's giving me the vibe that i'm going for it's very neutral it does have like some brown you know tones in there i love the way this pumpkin looks and also got this it's a neutral pumpkin this as well i got two of those and then i got these small pumpkins right here and again just what i'm going for in my vibe i'm thinking about putting this in my beauty room it has like a little black frame very simplistic i got this picture frame but this is the picture frame that i got it's just a line drawing and i got this from at home so this is what this looks like and it has like this little wooden frame you know kind of like this washed gray gray washed wooden frame and then i also got this one which is almost the same it just has almost like a partial head <laughs> on it so this is what this is what that looks like these were from at home i could have literally sketched that out myself and went to ikea and got a frame but realistically i've been thinking about doing that and it's just like i'm not gonna do that so i also got this like pumpkin here and it's basically the same as this small pumpkin see if i can pick it up so it's basically the same as the small pumpkin it's just a little bit bigger i got this little table decor as well and the next thing that i got from at home are some candles i am so in love i am so in love so this is shaped into a pumpkin like how freaking cute is that oh my god this is super cute so it has a wooden lid you guys know i love this wooden lid and this is how it is it smells so good this is the uh, vanilla pumpkin i don't know about you guys but i promise you fall is literally like my favorite time and i just cannot wait until it starts to get just a little bit chilly okay and i like my candles and it's just smelling like heaven up in here oh it smells so good this is like i said vanilla pumpkin oh my god baby and then i have this which i did not even see that it had this little stain on it but it's okay so i have this one which is also like super cute and it's giving you more pumpkin like vibes the wooden lid still and this is actually pumpkin spice and this smells good too the thing i got here is this little basket from target I also have these edison style light bulbs um for outdoor this is gonna go on the balcony so got that so i have these two pillows right here and i know it may look like bright oh there's the true color girl that is the true color of the pillows you see that i'm sorry zane is barking it's like this deep burnt orange and i just love it so much in the back it does have like a little button um i probably won't show this so it would just look like this and i'll put like a little you know what is it <laughs> you know a little karate chop here in the middle that'll be so cute so i have this i actually got two of these for the couch and then i got this here i think this is so cute oh my god it says hello fall i wanted something that wasn't too cheesy you know what i mean but i definitely wanted something that um look like this like had this type of like design you know what i mean like a something that says maybe blessed or uh thanksgiving or thankful or something like that but you guys will see it come together and then the last thing that i got from at home was this throw here so it definitely is still like the same vibes like look at this that is so cute look at that girl don't play with me don't play with me look at this together Look at those colors together. Beautiful. Beautiful. Stop playing with me. So this is how it looks all together. This is a little bit darker, but I still think it's gonna be a really nice look. And if it doesn't go, then girl, I will take it back. We are moving on to Target. This is the Joy and Gains brand. Um, this is measuring cups. I really needed some measuring cups. Like I had these childish measuring cups, like girl. Grow up. <laughs> and this is what they look like. They're just all black stainless steel. They're dishwasher safe. And then I got these measuring spoons here. And this is what they look like. Again, all black, really nice looking. So I love that. I plan to go to container store, but I need to like not be spending money. I just need to organize what I got. And then I got this Rise and Shine uh, mug here. If it will focus. You see this, this Rise and Shine mug. Oh my freaking gosh. I got this for um, from Target. Again, the Joanna Gaines uh, brand. This mug was only $4.99. And then the last thing I got was this blanket here. 
which was actually like a very expensive blanket. So I don't know if I'm gonna keep it or not or if it's gonna work for me. But it is the Casa Luna blanket. And this is what it looks like. It's the Casa Luna. It's the Casa Luna oversized hand knit bed throw. Um, and it has like, it says it's like a cloud like texture. Girl, it is so freaking like soft. Oh my God, it is so freaking soft. It's getting really, really dark and it's also raining, so that's why it's looking dark here. But yes, you guys, that completes this fall home decor haul. I am not finished. There's a few other places that I'm gonna go to just to check some things out. And I do wanna get like another blanket for the couch. Cause like I said, I'm just, want it to be like super duper cozy um and yeah but other than that like oh i have something else to show you i got these probably like two weeks ago um but i got these two little uh what are these like kitchen towels yeah these are a kitchen towel set of two i got these from home goods i promise you uh, i just had to turn the light on because it was getting really dark but anyway so this says let's eat this says farm raise this says boo and this says spooky. So I'll probably be putting these out first because of Halloween and then this more so for Thanksgiving. But you know, they're neutral colors, so it'll be okay. So yeah, that's what I got. But yeah, you guys, I spent like a lot of money and even though every year I'm like, I'm not gonna spend money on like, you know, these seasons, I'm lying, I'm gonna spend the money or whatever because I always see like new and cute things. But honestly, like these are just so neutral and I'm just on like just everything neutral right now. So I probably will reuse these pumpkins. And like I said, I'm going to my storage unit to find some other things. Um, and just reuse some of those things as well. And also you guys, like this is the last thing I wanna say or whatever. I know it's like, girl, get to it. Like, why are you still in the space? But like, I'm just like, so I had posted one of my videos today. It was a pretty little thing, try on home. And they sponsored me. So that was the first time ever sponsoring me. A lot of people thought that I was pregnant in that video. They, um, there was actually several comments about me being pregnant. And you know, I know that certain people don't really like mean any harm or anything, but you have to understand how insensitive those comments are or can be to someone. I think that you should never, ever, ever, ever mentioned to a woman at, that she's pregnant and I've already spoken on this like before like literally a year or so ago because I kept getting these comments that I'm pregnant and I'm just like baby if I was pregnant the the child would have been four by now okay because I'm literally coming up on my fourth year um on YouTube or whatever right yeah fourth year like you ain't seen no child all you seen is Zane but it is so insensitive you guys or whatever to make those type of comments to any woman if a woman doesn't come out and tell you that she's pregnant never assume never assume because you never know like that's just a sensitive topic in general and you never know if somebody is going through something they're trying to have kids they can't have kids miscarriages or anything like that that's just putting them back into a negative or triggering space so you should never even ask you should never ask somebody allow them to tell you one and then two people may have have medical conditions where it may make them appear pregnant but they're really not so I just say all that to say is just be very mindful whenever you're asking someone if they're pregnant um actually just don't ask at all like you know what I mean like if you peep it you peep it I've been getting those comments for years and it's just like god damn y'all I have a gut like my stomach just naturally comes out that way like there is nothing that I can do even whenever I've been my smallest my stomach has always came out that way I just don't I, I don't know what you want me to do. <laughs> Hold on. Look what mommy got. Hello, baby. <laughs> it's okay, sweet man. Come in here. Yes, good boy. Look what mommy got. Look what mommy got. No, 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 it's okay, Henry. It's okay. It's okay, baby. Yeah, it's okay. Zane's scared of the scarecrow. <laughs> it's okay, sweet man. I'm not upset about it, but I am passionate about it a little bit um, because like I stated, like I know that I'm not pregnant, so it is what it is. And then if I was, I wouldn't mind having that conversation with you guys because like I said, this is my job, it's my life or whatever. And especially with me being like more of a fashion-based channel, um, that I would have to disclose that shit to y'all sometime. <laughs> 
all i'm just trying to say is like i'm not pregnant my stomach just naturally just curves out and it all and it consistently looks like i'm bloated or slash pregnant like i have a bump but I do not. It just makes me a little bit self-conscious because like I know that, you know, it looks like I'm pregnant. <sighs> I'm also going to be trying sculpting out so it can kind of like smooth this area out just a little bit or whatever. And I know you guys are like, girl, you fine, like bumping people and stuff like that. Cause I, I, I believe that like, girl, I still eat what I want and I still go about my day. But <laughs> you know, when you're on the internet or you're doing something like what I do, like fashion, clothing calls, you have people that are looking at your body constantly and they tell you like girl you done lost some weight or girl you done gained some weight you know or girl are you pregnant or you're pregnant like little things like that when you see those comments and it's consistently popping up you know what i mean anytime you do like a haul or try on haul fashion video whatever it is it can be a lot okay it can be a lot but anyway you guys i know that was so long and drawn out but i just really had to get that off my chest because like i was like you know kind of a little upset about it today i was reading the comments trying to reply back and stuff like that and i seen that and i was just like damn i mean i know i gained a little weight but y'all ain't gotta keep coming at me like that y'all talking about i'm on break and i got pregnant and i'm like no I'm literally tending to myself. And so if you think I'm glowing, that's because your girl is literally tending to herself. Like she's not stressed trying to do this and that and the third, not at all. Literally just chilling, okay? She's got a lot of time to just self-reflect, rejuvenate and all that extra stuff. So yeah, girl. But anyway, I'm about to make this full girl and y'all get to see maybe tomorrow or the next day, the decoration process. I'm so excited, girl. So yeah, it's the sunset for me. Look how beautiful that is. Like, I know y'all ain't never really seen my view because of like privacy, but baby, all the way around, like all the way around my apartment. Hey baby, since this thing down here. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh my God. So we're about to do some decorating. I think my parents are supposed to come up. So I was saying, He's trying to get, so we're about to do some decorating. So I'm gonna get the place like all nice and cozy. And um, yeah, these are my other pair of glasses. Y'all might like these better cause you know, they're neutral, but the uh, clear ones are like my favorite. But these are nice too. I literally recorded all day and then I went to like Target, World Market and PetSmart and now I'm back at the house. And then just be like cozy for the rest of the night and maybe watch a movie, snuggle with Zane. Yeah, so let's get to it. So y'all, I like it, but I don't really like it. Like it's something, very much something <laughs> that I don't like about it. I don't know yet. Okay, so this is how it looks so far. Got the thankful pillow here on the side chair. This is how these pillows look. This is how these pillows look. 
and then I got this throw. This is how the table looks, which I actually really love. I haven't taken, I, I don't have the tags off just yet because I wanna make sure that I really like this before I um, settle on it. And I do like the table setup. Like I am feeling that. I added this little thing right here. I don't know if I should leave that there. This is my diffuser. I don't know if I should leave that there. Like I'm not sure, but yeah, this is what I have going on so far. But this is how it looks and I like that. But I don't know. Good morning, you guys. So today is Tuesday, September 7th. I am headed to actually take Zane or drop Zane off at the vet. You know, he's been having some complications since Friday. So we're just gonna go ahead and get him checked out just to make sure that everything is good. And um, what else? And then I'm probably gonna stop by my stores to see if there's anything else I need as far as as far as like fall decor um because i do have a few things that um that i did like from my last year decor and then and then i'm gonna check out this new coffee place here in charlotte north carolina i'm gonna like you know show y'all some stuff like b-roll and everything so if you're in charlotte you can check it out as well i'll let you know my thoughts about it and i'm just gonna do some work while I'm there, nothing too crazy, but just to get out the house and not, you know, be on the same like routine, like doing work in the house. So this will be my first time, well no, not really. So this will be my first time doing like work at this like uh, coffee shop, because again, this is, a, it just opened, but I'm not exactly sure when, probably like a few weeks ago, but this will be my first time like doing work in an actual coffee shop. So I'm excited about that. You know, it's something different. I just wanted to come and update you guys. Zane has not been feeling well, so I've just been really tending to him. And that's the reason why I haven't been vlogging lately since you last seen me. And I am going to kind of update you on the living room and how that's looking. Um, because I did fix some things and I, I really like it now. But yeah, just wanted to let you guys know and I'll talk to you later. <laughs> Symphony, just to say how much you mean to me. What would you do if I told you you were beautiful? Would you date me on the regular? Tell me, would you? Well, baby, I've been around the world, but I ain't seen myself another girl like you. This ring here represents my heart. There's just one thing I need from you Say I do Because I can see us holding hands Walking on the beach, our toes in the sand I can see us on the countryside Sitting on the grassland side by side You could be my baby Let me make you my lady Girl, you amaze me And gotta do nothing crazy See, all I want you to do is be my love So don't give away my love Good morning, you guys. Today is September 11th, I believe, and I'm actually headed out to go to the Charlotte Auto Fair. Um, I'm gonna show you my outfit really quick and then I'm gonna head out because I'm running late. Uh, my dad is here, so if you hear him, like he's talking to Zane, you know, playing around or whatever. But, um, girl, not the bad cloth. I'm just gonna show you really quick what I'm wearing. I'm going to the Charlotte Auto Fair. I go with my dad like every year. We didn't go last year, you know, for obvious reasons, but I'm wearing the Skims Outdoor set. If you haven't seen my review on it, go check it out. I just have the hoodie here tied around my neck, a little necklace, and then the top and the shorts. And also, I have on these um, Adidas NMD and some anklets, black socks. I got, I'm glad I got this because if I get cold, I can put it on my shoulders, around my waist, whatever. But, yeah, this is old look bedroom shoes right there, but yeah. And then I have my hair like this. I do have like this little bow. It kind of looks childish, but because I'm struggling with my ponytails right now it just kind of makes up for the length i'm missing <laughs> um same jury jbw watch all right so let's go
Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. 'Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go now. That's 67. $8,000. It is? You gonna buy that? Uh huh. No, I How much is it? I know I'm it ain't not. no eight. I know, I know it's that more than that. Sure, look man. at that one though. Uh, I like that one. This one, look at that driftwood. At the house. I said an Oldsmobile. Yeah, that's what I am. Hey, what's I did stop by the mall. I had to pick up a gift. I'm here. I walked in. My dad just left. 
and i am about to just chill out for the rest of the day like oh my god like that auto fare took me out okay it literally took me out it was super duper 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 hot okay like it was so hot you guys when you're out there in that heat like you can get dehydrated quickly um lose a lot of energy quickly there was like three or four people that passed out um and like the emts like when i say passed out like seriously passed out or whatever um i don't know why i look like red or whatever but one person like actually and i mean i literally seen him pass out on the ground somebody tried to catch him but he was a man he was real heavy and then there was also another young boy i would say he was probably like 12 or 13 and he passed out as well and the emts like they were already like on deck there i was like damn you know what i mean like it's just crazy out here because y'all are not hydrating and not taking breaks because me and my dad was out there for like three hours almost three hours like imagine being out there for three to four hours and you're just in direct sun and you're just on go 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 and you're not drinking water like you know they were coming on the intercom telling people like hey there's emts here you know what i mean if anything happened but make sure you're hydrating and also the food there is super duper expensive and very nasty like me and my dad got two corn dogs um some fries water a sprite and some lemonade and it was 37 dollars one man said he paid 18 dollars for two ice creams for him and his son I said, uh-uh, but anyway, yeah, so, yeah, I am, I don't know, I felt like this vlog was all over the place or whatever, but girl, you know, I gotta do what I can. I am so tired, okay, literally been on go since like 7 a.m. this morning, so I am just going to like relax and finish watching, I think it's called Clickbait on Netflix, like, it is good to me, I like it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, I'll see you next week.